Hello students. Chemical reactions are very fascinating because we get various color changes. Today's experiment is five in one colors. I have my colleague Sapna with me who is going to do an experiment in which simply let me say in brief that she is going to pour one solution into another solution and you will see that every stage there is a different color. What this is about we shall see afterwards. So I will request Sapna to start by first telling us what these solutions are and how you are going to proceed with the experiment. Chemicals requirement for this experiment first one is water containing a few drops of phenolphthalein solution. This is a sodium carbonate solution. This is a ferric chloride solution. This is a ammonium thiocyanate solution. This is a potassium ferrocyanate solution. So now what are you going to do Sapna? First, first I am taking a phenolphthalein solution. So first you will take phenolphthalein yes. solution and you will yeah, pour, pour it into, into the second next beta. Next beta. and you will continue like yes, that. Sir. So let us see what are the changes that are taking place. Okay sir. Now I am taking the solution first one. This is a phenolphthalein. So second one pour to the third beaker. This is the ferric chloride solution. This is a um, this is ammonium thiocyanate solution. This is potassium ferrocyanate solution. So students you saw that from a colorless solution we got different colored solutions. For example when we started, we started with a solution which was colorless like this. Then we took this solution and added to the next beaker which became pink like this. But the original color of the solution in the beaker was like this. So the colorless solution became pink. Then we took, Sapna please hold this. Then we took the pink colored solution and added to the next which became brown like this and the original color of that solution was like this. We then took this solution and added to the other one over here whose original color was colorless like this. And finally when we took this solution and add it to the last one which was originally like this. So they were almost out of the five solutions, four were colorless, one was slightly yellow in color and now you have got different colors over here. The explanation is very simple and it is as follows. This is an indicator when added to a base, it changed its color. The indicator was phenolphthalein. When we have taken the base and added to an iron chloride solution, that is ferric chloride solution, it has formed iron hydroxide or it has formed iron ions, ferric ions and ferrous ions. These ferrous and ferrous ions then react with thiocyanate and with Potassium, potassium ferricyanide to give the various colors. So quite a fascinating way from a colorless solution you get four to five different colors. I hope you all enjoyed it and there's a lot of chemistry involved in this. Thank you.